Go ahead and hit those buttons, and there we go. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fight, robots, fight! Dark Child getting their weapon up to speed. Red Hawk doing the same. What we're gonna see here is uh, we're gonna look for some real reliability and durability on those wheels from Star Child. That is the only way they're gonna survive this onslaught from the horizontal bar. And land those hits on the top of the bot. And they've gotta be very careful when they launch that. Oh, oh. nice hit from Star Child digging into that wheel well on Red Hawk. It looks like they might be stuck. I think Star Child went through the top plate, Kyle. Directly through the top plate into that drive side. All right, Brett's gonna try to separate these two. But we got these bots very stuck together. Brett, let's see if we can give them a nice, nice separation hit. All right, it looks like Red Hawk is dead. I agree. Is and this a count out? Can, oh. No, Red Hawk's Red weapon, Hawk's weapon, weapon is still today. going, okay. They do appear to have one side of their drive still working. All right, All right. here like we go. We're so we're gonna get a match. separation here on this match. Now, it's very important here so we'll have that safety is, uh, is, is really paramount. We need to uh, see if we can unstick these two robots. Oh, okay. That's not safe. <laughs> that weapon of Star Child. That weapon of Star Child is dug in deep into Red Hawk. It, they're gonna have to spend some time. Hey, all right, we're gonna get the weapon locks in all these right, weapons looks like right now. They're asking the builders to come over and put weapon locks in. Yeah, we're All right. gonna send that one to the judges. This is uh, going to go to the judges. Yeah, there you go. All right, we have event organizer Austin McCord here. Austin, uh, we saw you heroically go in there and uh, yeah, try so, and separate these. Your thoughts? Well, um, I, I'm the one who's willing to risk my fingers here because um, I'm insured. But uh, yeah, no, so we've never had robots that stuck together before. Um, that's a that's a new one for us. So uh, I don't know. We got to go to the judges and figure out what they say because the judges' decisions are final here. But yeah, we've never had robots that are that stuck together before. Awesome. All right. All right. Uh, let's start off with uh, with Craig. Craig uh, didn't have a, a chance to change his shirt, but I'm interested in hearing your opinions. Um. So. At the point where he got stuck, that was Star Child's first and only attack that really, really landed. All of the rubber has come off of his uh, wheel on one side, and that's because of uh, was it Red Hawk um, did all of that. Um, so up until the point of the the stick, uh, you have to do it for Red Hawk. I think if it carried on after that, I think Star Child would have won. But if we're at the point of stopping, it's uh, it's Red Hawk. Controversial. Okay, I like it. Uh, so uh, you're gonna give it to Red Hawk, is that right? Am I understanding that correctly? Wow. Okay, Zach, uh, your thoughts? Well, uh, I think my preferred solution to this problem would be to turn both robots off and separate them in the pit, and then have them finish the second half of the fight from their corners again. But failing that, if it has to go to the judges. I think I have to give it to Star Child. Ooh, okay. I think uh, the tape was pulled off the wheels, but it wasn't causing him mobility problems. He was yep. obviously able to get enough torque over the top to swing the, the axe through. That damage to the top was so much more significant than that tape was, that if you count the end of the fight as when we had to so stop the match, I think he's winning on damage okay. and uh, had the momentum. So I got to give it to Star Child. Uh, All right, so we've got 
We have an option that was given to the builders if they wanted to redo that entire fight. Wow. Okay. So, um, and they're willing to. And they're willing to. So we're going to have a redo of they're that They're going to have a redo. Like right now with half half powered batteries. I love it. Okay. So here we go. We're going to redo that entire fight. Wow. Like reset the clock and everything. Yeah. I don't see any reason why not um this is going to be interesting we've never had that bad of a sticking yeah in this and um so it's going to be interesting to see what direction this ends up going that is really interesting i didn't think that we would see that kind of power from the weapon of star child it's a very sharp little blade and we've that's, seen it do some really good damage awesome. to the top of these bots all right surprise redo let's go red hawk star child part two Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fight robots fight again. And we see that weapon getting up to speed on both robots. Star Child trying to get their angles in. Oh, oh my God, Kyle! <laughs> again, again! <laughs> oh, there is Kyle, there is a God. I love it. There is something. I about love it. the material on the top of Red Hawk and the weapon material on Star Child, which I believe is S7, that just uh, just sticks together. This is wow. yes. This is uh, this is how you get a Voltron, folks. I, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> nope. This, this is, is the uh, most delightful thing I've seen today. Oh. Hey, oh my God. Right, we got yes. separation. Yes. Oh, with two minutes left to go in this match. Can Brandon do it a third time? Now we've got weapon spin up, it looks like, on Star Child, but I have not seen the weapon come back on Red Hawk. Did, it, did they lose weapon in that last exchange? It looks like Red Hawk's weapon is down. That's impressive. So the so presumably the weapon of Star Child landed right into either the drive motor or something important to the weapon system on Red Hawk. It is not functioning right now. And it looks like we're not seeing the same speed of Star Child's weapon here. No, for sure. But then again, he could be running it a little bit slower so he doesn't get stuck again. You know what? Uh, if it's running, it's uh, it's running, you know? Absolutely, yeah, you're still getting damage points if you're getting that thing in there. Oh, there we go. That was a wheel guard, it looked like, off of the side of Red Hawk because they ran underneath Star Child and that weapon ripped that wheel guard right off. Seeing damage, you know, from Star Child's outside of these, these two really... No! Kyle! Kyle, it happened! It happened a third time! <laughs> what? Wow. It is so close, and they are trying wow. desperately to thwack their robot out. Tap it's out. It's a tap out. Kyle. All right. Star Child. Kyle, I love this match. Star Child.